Well, we all have those moments when the roads or people on the road to <laughs> make us say, this is just driving me crazy. Maybe it's a person behind the wheel or a pothole, but a lot of you tell us about your problems oh, yeah. that you have out on the road. And that's why our morning reporter Pepper Baker is launching this new segment to help you get the answers to what is driving you crazy. This morning she joins us live in Bon Air. So good morning, Pepper. What have you been hearing? Good morning, Aaron. Now look here, the yield sign at this right turn at the Thompson Mill Road um, Highway 96 intersection has a stoplight above it. Now Gary Mooker wrote into 13 WMAZ telling us why this right here is driving me crazy. Oh yes, I do use this road every day, every day. Rarely do we ever turn and go up the old 96. Gary Mooker knows this area of Bonaire well, frequenting Highway 96 and Thompson Mill Road in East Houston County, just south of Robbins Air Force Base. We've actually were one of the first families that's moved out in here, and at that time we were moving out into the woods, and that was like 33 years ago. He's watched the road work turning 96 into a four lane from the start. When the intersection first opened, he says it flowed. Initially when they set it up, it was very easy to go in and out of the area and uh, you can see cars coming through with the yield sign down there. He's pointing specifically to this yield sign when you make this right onto Thompson Mill Road. But see, the Georgia Department of Transportation put a stoplight above, and now he's confused. As I looked at it more and more and drove through it and was, it was wondering, you know, it's like driving me crazy. Which one do I obey? The red light or the yield sign when I'm making that right-hand turn off of 96. We wanted to help Gary get answers. I got in touch with Penny Brooks at the Georgia Department of Transportation. It turns out Brooks says that stoplight isn't meant for drivers making a right turn. The straight through lanes follow the, the light signals. Basically, that's easy to understand. Brooks says the stoplight alerts drivers coming around the curve on Highway 96 of the traffic signal ahead. Right lane turners follow the yield sign, not the traffic light. Using the yield, they need to keep an eye out on the left hand, making sure nobody is coming. But if nobody is coming, they can move straight lane on into uh, Thompson Mill Road. OK, so just to be clear, if you're making this right on a Thompson Mill Road, the stoplight is not for you. Follow the yield sign. I hope that makes one less problem that's driving people crazy. Live in Bon Air, Pepper Baker, 13 WMAZ News. Aaron, back I, to you. Thank you, Pepper. I definitely think it helps somebody this morning. Well, that intersection is right down the road from the new Bon Air Primary School that's currently under construction. But if there is something on the road that is driving you crazy, we do want to hear about it to help you get some answers. So send us an email to news at 13wmaz.com or reach out to Pepper herself on her Facebook page and she will be happy to get you some answers. What would it take to prepare the funding 